Yeah. Yeah. All right, yeah. all, all your mark. Yes. You, you perform better with coffee? Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Hundred years of Australian football out of everyone. You've probably got more stories than this book can hold, but let's have a little look. Uh, Where do we start? What did you what did you have to start? Yeah. Uh, that that is special. These people what they have done, it's it's just what they sacrifice. Yeah. What they uh, 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 personal sacrifice that uh, it's just impossible to explain. I don't think people truly, yes, we know, you know, some names and, and what happened and the, about the tour, but the sacrifices that that they made in terms of being able to be a part of this team, you know, the sacrifices, you know, that, that would have cost a lot to them. The stories of, of, um, of these people, they were unique characters. They were unique uh, human beings. They were prepared to sacrifice everything that human would sacrifice. And uh, I have never ever met a better bunch of human beings than that. We were traveling by truck. Yeah. <laughs> so Where was this taken? I, I don't know. I, I, I see so many pictures <laughs> in my life. <laughs> Great coffee. Could probably still be playing now if he wanted to. Young Frankie. Uh, what a football talent. Yeah, that's, a, that's a three big shot. Cahill, Aloisi and Q. Yeah. Uh, that's a brilliant picture. Hey. It's so symbolic, come on. It's a good mix, really, of, of these wonderful, wonderful players. Oh, oh 1922. Oh, God. You see, irrespective, irrespective, Mark, what we do, this is the first time that I know that we are looking at our true history. Yeah. And true history belongs to these people too. And these people deserve to be mentioned and to be part of it as long as we live. These people will never die. Yeah. That's what we are missing when we are on the tour, so you know yes. yourself. This was after, this was Russia, after Peru. The reason they came onto the field was at that time, to me, that was my my last game and my daughter was upset because she basically said to me I've only ever known you playing football <laughs> so and she was really emotional and that's why that's why she ended up on the pitch because she was sort of upset and needed that that comfort that is pure emotion yeah you know what game this was Ooh. in Sydney the um, the final against Korea South Korea it was um, very, very emotional, be probably because the whole tournament, so before the tournament, and was very conscious and really drove home the history of the Socceroos. Mm. What previous generations had given for mm. us to be in the position we are now. Yeah. And a heavy focus for the whole tournament was the individual sacrifices that we made to play this game in this country. You know, we, yeah. we all we all have our, our very own story in, in what we had to do. It would have been the same for you and probably more so mm. of what we had to deal with to, to do what we loved. Sokaru's story is always super story. What, what's, the, what's the highlight for you? This word Sokaru uh, is that 74 or 78 or 82 or 206 makes no difference. Such a pride and honor, a privilege for me to talk about. 